Hello everyone. In the last video, we have seen what is excretion. So we are going to see the excretion in humans in this video. Now when I say excretory system in human, it only means that the removal of nitrogenous waste that is excreted through the urethra. But before the waste is excreted through urethra, it passes three other organs also. So we can say that the excretory system includes four organs in all. There are a pair of kidneys, a pair of ureters, a urinary bladder and the urethra. Now first the all waste materials gets collected into the pair of kidneys. Now these kidneys are located in the abdomen one on either side of the backbone. Now the urine is produced into the kidneys. Now they are transferred into the ureter and where it is stored in the urinary bladder. Now the urinary bladder releases it through the urethra. Now the removal of urine or the production of urine is important because it involves the removal of waste materials just like the carbon dioxide is removed from the blood through the lungs. So it makes it important for the removal of urine because it consists of urea, uric acids and many harmful salts. Now the kidney has many blood rich capillaries which we call as nephrons. Now these nephrons are richly supplied blood capillaries which has a Bowman capsule. Now these Bowman capsule plays an important role in the reabsorption process. Reabsorption means whatever the waste materials has been reached to the kidney, it is reabsorbed that is the glucose, amino acids, essential minerals which have by chance come with the waste materials are reabsorbed there and transferred again to the body. And the other waste materials which are remaining there are passed on to the further filtration process. Now there are many blood capillaries present there for the absorption. So these blood capillaries are in the form of clusters. These clusters are attached to the cup shaped end where the filtered urine gets accumulated. Now the urine produced in pair of kidneys is transferred through the ureter to the urinary bladder. So we can say that the ureter acts as a connector between the urinary bladder and the kidneys. Now the urine is stored in the urinary bladder until the pressure of the expanded bladder leads to the urge to pass it through the urethra. Now the bladder is muscular and hence is under nervous control. As a result, we can usually control the urge to urinate. Now accumulation of waste into the body can lead to harmful effects. So the people whose kidneys does not work properly undergoes dialysis process to remove this nitrogenous waste. Now we have seen the excretion system in the humans. We are going to see the excretion in plants in the next video.